So I was kind of debating between whether I wanted to do a second part to this or not. But the Vampire Eddie X soon to be Vampire Cub Via got so much like, so much view, worship, even was loved by Cub Via herself. So I decided, you know what? Get. I'm going to be doing a part two. So here's part two. My beautiful sweethearts. Come with me. Eddie takes Cub back to an old palace. It was very, very creepy looking, and it was full of bats. Welcome to your new home, sweetheart. You can forget all about Hawkins High. We can forget all about those people. Because soon, it'll just be our kingdom once again. Once we reclaim it. Oh. Those two. Well. Let's not worry too much about those two. I'm sure that they'll come. And if not, we'll simply just get them over here. But for now, let's just focus on getting our kingdom back. This is our palace. You two, the two go inside. Well, darling, how does it look? Yeah, I know it's great. But nothing is as pretty as you. You're so cute. I love you so much. Now, I might as well show you what powers you're capable of, my dear queen. A few hours have passed. And now you know my beautiful sweetheart, my loving queen. And now, it is time we reclaim our kingdom. And after that, we should celebrate. My, I'm glad that you wanted to move alongside me. Honestly, I thought you were just going to forget about me like all the rest. But you didn't. And so you'd be perfect as my queen. I love you too, darling. Oh. Come on, my love. Let's go. A few more hours have passed. They have reclaimed their kingdom once again. Oh, my darling. Everything I could have hoped for. I remember this. I am your Eddie, son. Vampire or not, I'm still yours. And you are still mine. Cub, sweetheart. I'll never let you go again. Till not even death do us part. Alright, my love. Good. Now that our kingdom is back, I say it's time we take over. Oh, but wait, we're going to need a bit of help on that. Hmm. Maybe we can do a little bit of convincing with our two little friends. Maybe we can get them to help out in a way. I mean, they still care about us. They're still our, our friends. And they know that. So, they'll have to help us. And if they don't, well... 
That's when we just take matters into our own hands. But let's try not to focus on that, sweetheart. Like I said, we got our kingdom back, so we might as well celebrate. Cub and Eddie both turn into bats and fly off. Alright, sweetheart. You know, I was actually flying around this whole place for this whole, for, this whole woods for quite a while. And then I look down. They st land on a nearby tree. Do you remember this tree? We carved our names into this tree. You see that? Eddie x Natalie. See? Remember that? Yeah. Yeah. And that picnic table. That's where I got to hold your hand at for the first time where I got to kiss you for the first time while we were still alive and I had so many great memories uh, with you on that picnic table yeah darling I know <sighs> if only if only they just understand. Listen, but they don't matter anymore. All that matters is the kingdom in you. I am so happy that you decided to come for me. I'll keep reminding you that every single time. You, how you came for me. When you could have just left. I am very happy for it. I love you so, so much, Cub. Uh, so, are you enjoying this new life of yours? Being the vampire queen? Good, good. You're just so, so amazing. And I just want you to be happy. And I'm glad that you're happy just being my queen. Thank you. My beloved. As king and queen, I can tell that we have a lot ahead of us. And Chris, as for Crystal and Eli, they'll fit quite nicely in our legacy. And we'll make sure that they are top rank. I mean, they've done so much for us. They planned our wedding, approved of the ship, all that stuff. And I'm just very, very grateful for it. Are you? Yeah. Crystal, a very great w waitress. Yeah. She really knows how to make someone feel welcome in a at a cafe so I feel like she should be very worthy and also Eli is a very good friend a very good provider provides all sorts of amazing stuff finally we can finally I've been waiting for us to be together again after death I, again, I'm sorry that I had to disappear like that, but sometimes stuff like that just happens, okay? The point is, you're mine again. You're my queen. I'll be your king. And that's all that matters to me.
I love you so much, my queen. Now, you guys might be wondering, what's going on with Crystal and Eli? Well, for them, they're still at the old cottage. Oh, oh God, little bro. I don't know what to do. Should we go after them? Should we go look for them? No, 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 no. I don't know about that. I, I just, I don't really think, consider it. Yeah, little bro, I bet you don't. But have you seen? The bats are now multiplying like crazy. I wonder if that means, I hope they don't go corrupted. Do you think they might have gone corrupted? I don't know. I mean, I hope not. Yeah. But hey, that could just be me exaggerating. I don't know. All right. All right, then. Uh, I wonder, is it safe to even go outside? No, 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 it's not safe out. Come on. Let's just, we got to stay in here. Come on. It's been days. I've been in here for a while. At least we got at least, at least we got plenty to eat. Yeah, we do. So don't worry too much about it, big sis. Well, we'll be fine. Um, okay, if you say so. Cool. Listen. Listen. Um, big sis, I was actually wondering. Do you ever think that we'll ever find those two again? Yeah, yeah, sure, I do. And I'm hoping that we do actually find them, because, you know, who knows what they're up to. I mean, they're both vampires now, but um, still, they're our friends. We care about them so much. And yeah, I guess you're right. Yeah. Yeah. So... We're just going to stay here until we get an idea of where they are. And then we'll find something to protect ourselves with. Okay, little bro. Back with Eddie and Cub. They're back at the palace and in their bedroom. My love. That was so fun. I, I have a little surprise for you. Eddie takes out a box of a heart shaped box and opens it with some of your favorite well, I don't know if it's your favorite, but some very sweet looking blood gushers. All just for you. Very sweet. Eddie takes one and places it in Cub's mouth. You like that, darling? Yeah. They're very, 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 very amazing. I've had these for a while, and I never had someone to share them with, but now I have someone to share these with. I decided to make it special by putting in this heart-shaped chocolates box. All sorts of little sweets in here that I just know that you'll love since you're a vampire now. I love you so much, Cub. I'm glad that you love me, too. Allow me. Eddie takes Cub's hand and kisses it. My beautiful vampire queen. Um, I love you so, so much. So, that's about it for this video. Also, I want to let you guys know that I was suggested to do a Nagito Komai, not ex-listener, um, confession video. So, be on the lookout for that, okay? Okay. And also, I'm glad to say I have found somebody to collab with. And I'm excited to work with her. She seemed really cool. And, um... Yeah, just be on the lookout for a collab.